Hello and welcome to Miss Kay's Book Corner. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to my channel for the latest reading and related book activity. The book that is in my corner today is Elmer's Walk. Elmer, the patchwork elephant, was sniffing some flowers when some other elephants hurried by. Come and smell these flowers, Elmer called. We don't have time, Elmer, said an elephant. We are hurrying somewhere. Do you see the flowers? Not long after that, Elmer was looking at an old tree trunk. Three crocodiles charged past. Hey, crocodiles, called Elmer. Look, there's a log pretending to be one of you. Another time, Elmer, shouted a crocodile. And one after another, they plunged into the water and disappeared. Where is that log that looks like a crocodile? Lion came running past while Elmer was listening to the waterfall. Hey ho, lion, said Elmer. Come and, I don't have time now, Elmer, lion interrupted. I'm late for a very important nap. Then he was gone. The monkeys came swinging through the trees just as Elmer noticed a spider's web that had captured some drops of rain. Look, called Elmer. Yes, yes, lovely, delightful, amazing, said the monkeys without looking or slowing down. Where is that spider's web? Do you see it? Continuing his walk, Elmer paused to watch the river play with his reflection. The group of elephants raced by again. Stop a moment, said Elmer. Before he could say more, an elephant said, No time, Elmer. Sorry, we are still hurrying somewhere. Elmer was alone again. Do you see his reflection? When the birds flew by, Elmer had no chance to say anything about the rocks he was looking at. They flew past him quickly with just a, Hello, Elmer. No time to stop. Elmer sighed and walked on. Suddenly, a noise made Elmer think the elephants were back. It was the hippos. Look at the clouds, said Elmer. There's one that looks like an elephant. That's funny, Elmer. So do you, said a hippo. The others laughed and ran on without even a glance at the clouds. Where is that cloud that looks like an elephant? Elmer was watching the butterflies dance when Tiger galloped by. Steady, Tiger, said Elmer. Tiger slowed and said, Elephants may not know about tea time, but tigers certainly do. And I don't intend to miss it. No time to stop. Sorry. Bye. Do you see the butterflies? Later, Elmer met Snake. You know, Snake, he said. It's sad. Nobody has time to just stop and stare. I agree, said Snake. Sad. Very sad. For instance, said Elmer, look at those flowers. They have more colors than you and I put together. But Snake had already left. Where are the flowers? The elephant rushed by again when Elmer was listening to his echo. He didn't try to stop them. I know, he said. You are busy hurrying somewhere. You are silly, Elmer, an elephant laughed. Can't you see? We're hurrying back from somewhere. Elmer just sighed. Ah, 
Hurry, 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 murmured Elmer as he strolled on. Then he saw his cousin, Wilbur. Hello, Wilbur, he said. What are you doing? Watching the night arrive, said Wilbur. Where is Wilbur? Do you see his cousin, Wilbur? The cousins stood happily together and watched the sky darken and fill with stars. Shall we count them? asked Wilbur. No, said Elmer. We haven't the time. The end. Come and join me soon at Miss Kay's Book Corner for the activity that is inspired by today's book reading.